Hey, so I'm trying to move into a more senior ML role, but the field is moving way too fast. How do I stay competitive? Uh, that's a very good question that comes up uh, quite a bit when I talk to people. Uh, either they want to move into senior roles like yourself, uh, or they're thinking about starting their own venture. Uh, and usually my point of view and advice is the same. You, you need to do a lot of uh, projects to add to your portfolio and also you know, gain a lot of experience uh, before making the next move. When I was a data scientist, I was trying to solve this problem for myself. Uh, so I started an AI community uh, that so far has grown to more than 10,000 people globally. Uh, along the way, uh, we started iGrid Intellect, a platform that uh, connects people uh, to exchange expertise as well as collaborate with each other. So your recommendation is to do these projects and then you run these challenges in monthly cohorts that everyone can join for free? What's the catch? Uh, there is no catch. Uh, all you need to do is to tell us what you want to build, how you might build it, and who you might build it with. Uh, you can bring your own friends, uh, or you can meet people through our platform and team up with them. Cool, cool. So how do I tell you what I want to build? Uh, what you need to do is to submit a proposal. Uh, but don't worry about it. You don't have to uh, come up with this proposal yourself. We provide a template that is fairly detailed, uh, as well as uh, a video series on AI product development that will guide you through forming your idea and answering some of the questions that we're asking in the template. Really interesting. So I need to have my own concrete project idea? Not necessarily. Uh, my recommendation is to work on something that you're very passionate about uh, because you can usually tell a very interesting narrative about it. Uh, but you could also meet people on our platform and team up with them uh, and you know, brainstorm about what idea you want to work on. Uh, in importantly and interestingly, we also usually bring in startup companies uh, to sponsor projects and these projects are uh, usually building product features for business problems that they're trying to solve. So you could work on those, uh, get your hands dirty with some real life and real world experience. Um, and there is cash prizes that companies are sponsoring uh, through these challenges. If you want to learn as much as you like on a theoretical scale, you can do that. But if you really want to, to build something, Aggregate intellect challenges are the way to go, where you build real products with real people to solve real problems and they have real consequences. Uh, you, you should definitely take this challenge because you will go through the ML development product the right way and at the end of it you will have a functioning ML product that you can share with your friends and colleagues and uh, set yourself apart. This is live, this is real world. These are real projects with real data and real teams. And most meaningfully, these are real outcomes. Like we, we produce stuff that, you know, will probably be used by the company. Dude, love it. I'm going to sign up right now at ai.science slash challenge. And you, you out there, join me for the next cohort. What are you waiting for?